This is Bird Note. In the 19th and early 20th century, the human fascination with bird feathers went a little too far. Women's hats and dresses featured extravagant feathers from birds both near and far. To fulfill the growing demand for feathered hats in the UK, birds were imported to the fashion hub of London from all over the world. The trade in feathers drove several species, from the little egret to the great crested grebe, to near extinction. Fed up with the killing of wild birds for fashion, a group of British women, led by Emily Williamson, met in 1889 to put an end to this cruelty. The group, called the Society for the Protection of Birds, united with another group of protesting women, the Fur, Fin, and Feather Folk, founded by Eliza Phillips. The organization became the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds, or RSPB, which continues to be a leader in bird conservation today. The RSPB rallied for a ban on the import of feathers for three decades until the British Parliament passed the Importation of Plumage Prohibition Act in 1921. Thanks to a group of women who challenged the feather fad, many species of birds were protected from extinction. For Bird Note, I'm Ariana Rimmel. Want more Bird Note sounds, images, and stories delivered straight to your inbox? Subscribe to our weekly newsletter for a preview of the week's shows, stories, and stunning photos every Friday morning. Visit birdnote.org to sign up today.